Good morning, folks. This is a close-up of the large sunspot group in 304 angstroms. You're seeing ionized helium. CME appears to be in the making, along with some solar flare activity this morning. We'll discuss that. An earthquake watch in effect. Strange sights at the edge of space with a cut video feed and more summer snow. But we begin at spaceweathernews.com. Finding the last day on our star was relatively calm except for eyes on that bright active region turning to center disk. As we speak this morning, a small eruption appears to be taking place. We will keep our eyes on it. Solar flaring up off the floor but having trouble making larger flares. The large sunspot group we're watching has stopped its general growth and is mostly morphing. When analyzing the structure, we note a further spreading of the region and actually slightly less dangerous of a magnetic character today. But alas, she still has the potential to fire, so eyes open. And again, those eyes today are on the eruptive activity developing at this grouping center disk. All updates and analysis of CMEs will be at spaceweathernews.com. Solar wind continuing to calm as we are between streams. Another one is expected early this week, however, from the southern coronal hole here. We expect a sector boundary with it as well, right as the northern coronal hole begins to face Earth. And as many of you saw on Twitter yesterday at our disaster prediction app scoring, the sunspot quake score is rising as well as a peak in total coverage. Uptick in seismicity expected before Tuesday with all those factors in play. Okay, folks, I want to get your comments on this one. Lots of chatter going around about the ISS feed being cut upon seeing an object entering Earth's atmosphere. Could be space junk, could be a UFO, or the Chinese space station Tiangong-1, which has been speculated to be spinning out of control. Things like this can happen, but the timing of the video feed cut is of suspicion, just like with the Soho coronagraph cuts, and just like with those, this is not the first time the ISS feed has been cut upon seeing something interesting. Leave your thoughts on what you're seeing here. Back down to Earth, where Europe saw the Rockies toss some snow up on the scoreboard and said, hey, we can do that. Not only is July snow rare in this area, but this event brought it down to very low elevations. And at this time of year, there may not be any record of such a snow event at that location in our history. We'll leave off here with a look at the East Pacific hurricane situation. They keep popping up and running west, but Hawaii has been getting lucky thus far. Folks, not only was yesterday Saturday, so our weekly podcast, Fly on the Wall, was uploaded to suspiciousobservers.org, but we got Deeper Look episode 57 out as well. A look at some of the links posted by Gatherer in the comments regarding a coming grand solar minimum. Got pressure and radar forecast, followed by shots of our star to close. It's 4 a.m. in the new valley of the sun. Eyes open, no fear. Be safe, everyone.